Hey, I'm Shar. Welcome to Readings. If you like the way I read, please like, share, and subscribe. Falls to the left. Let's keep it Libra. Who left? Someone left. Someone went to some calmer waters. Falls to the left. Spirit speaks. Got to keep it. Libra. How y'all doing, darlings? I miss you guys. Haven't been out for a, a day. Oh my God. One day felt like a lifetime. I've been away from you. Okay, come on. Let's go. Let's stop the chit chat. Let's go. Let's get her on. And let's get her done. Libra, let's get her on. Let's get her done. Come on. Somebody left. My God caused a lot of pain, a lot of weariness, a lot of heaviness. Very, very painful indeed. Look at this. Could barely stand. You know what? If the tower wasn't here, this is definitely a tower. With those two cards put together, there was a lot of hurt and pain. You wanted something fiery hot with this person, but there was something that you weren't seeing. Now, normally this means that there is a whole brand new beginning coming towards you, but no, not today. There's no whole brand new beginning. This was a fiery hot thing that you had going with somebody. But Libra, there was something that you weren't seeing. And it caused, there was a hell of an uproar in the emotions there. Look at this. Laying in that bed waiting for the nine swords to fall. Trust me, the nine swords have already fallen. Can't let it go. Because it appears that this was the person of your dreams with the emperor here. Now the emperor, let's swing it around, guys. This could be someone who could be a little bit um, difficult at times, but it's someone who appears to be the one made just for you. Tickety boo. Let's just bring it down a little bit there, darling. Maybe you can see my shirt. So what we got here is um, this person appeared to be something that stepped out of a dream and then ended up in a nightmare. But I gotta tell you, gotta <laughs> wow, Libra coming out here. Woo, what happened? Okay, what's going on here? Someone definitely coming back with an apology for you. Somebody definitely coming with an apology. Star card, great possibility. Great possibility also means miracles. You know, with this kind of pain, you're gonna almost I'm going to need a miracle to mend this, but what I got is Libra coming out to say hello here. Libra, who's already been there, has already had that pain, has now experienced all of this. Now, taking a stand. I'm going to put up some boundaries. I'm going to make a judgment call. Let's go, Libra. My God Almighty doubled up in Libra cards. Bang, bang. There we go. Look at this. Some kind of friggin' karma coming in, some kind of justification. Yes, indeed, weighing out the balances. Weighing out the balances. And we got when the balances are weighed out, we got making a judgment call, we got putting up boundaries, and then on the other side, weighing it out. Got a whole beginning here. Somebody wants to make an offer, somebody wants to stand on the crossroads here with you. Well, now, now I don't know if you ever heard the story about what the crossroads truly are. But the crossroads is a place where you can make a deal with the devil or you can make a deal with God. So be real careful. Who are you going to make a deal with? So, but what I got is some kind of karma here that this person has felt. There was money here. Something about money. What about money? Let's give them a shuffle. Spirit says, shuffle them up. Something about money. Some kind of conversation coming in, talking about money. Maybe even talking about a business. Somebody that you might have been in the business with. Someone you might have wanted to start something up with. Maybe a YouTube channel. Something like that. 
but there's some kind of communication coming in here. Libra. But somebody walked away before the money could come in. There's definitely something here about money, Libra. I don't know who I'm, I'm hitting on. This could have been a partner of yours, a lover and a partner. Someone that might have shared a business with you. Or somebody that might have tried to talk you into coming into their business. Come on in, I'll make you this or that. And, and you can do this for me and you do that. You can do like the, the paperwork or the book work. Or, or maybe you can be the master mechanic. Come on in. I'm going to make you a boss or something like that. But it was walked away from before before the money could arise. It was walked away before anything was done. But now communication coming in talking about this here money project. It could also be spirit speaking by God spirit speaking. It could also be something about a house that the two you might have shared. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Maybe some kind of business dealings that you guys are going to do something about a house. Maybe maybe you're going to split down the middle with the assets or something. But somebody might have walked away before all of this was done. There's a lot of maybes. Oh, yeah. It's definitely coming back. You got the apology coming in here, Libra. You got miracles, you got the apology. You got all of a sudden like, okay, you know, like the last time you walked away and you kind of left me in a bad place. Here comes the judgment sounding its mighty trumpet, bringing it back from the dead. Bam, truth. There it is, truth and not just truth, victory. Here it comes, everything that you want. It could be dealing with a Gemini, it could be dealing with a lot of signs there. When I got a big thinker too, you know, someone that's uh, someone who is a, a thinking kind of a person, male or female. Come on, guys. Younger person probably than you. Young in their passion. Young in their thoughts. Young in their love. Could be someone that's been just, you know, just... You, you, it could be their second boyfriend or their second girlfriend, you know? Somebody young, immature, playful, fun-loving. Very, very, very fun-loving. But somebody, too, who seems to be in the tower. <laughs> There's no doubt about that whatsoever. There is no doubt in my mind that this person's in the tower. So you're in a kind of a tower with a lot of heavy feelings and a lot of burdens and and that bastard and they're in the tower male or female they're in the tower thinking oh my god and we all know what we think when we're in the tower we don't we don't think we just feel a lot of feeling like i can't breathe my chest feels heavy I can't think. There is no thought process when you're in the tower. There's just the enormous, enormous, crushing amount of pain. Get your t-shirts on. Here comes a bastardo. What do you got to say? Bastardo says, you got options, Libra. You got options. You don't have to fall for this. We got here the uh, King Neptune himself, King of the Sea coming in you got options with this person person's going to come to you with a lot of watery emotion a lot of emotion in the tower crushed feeling bad you got a lot of truths coming towards you somebody's going to spend a lot of time talking a lot of time talking the high priestess use your intuition libra because i got who we we doggies. Okay, I didn't see this coming because I know Libras. And Libras can have such big hearts, much like Pisces can. But I got a Libra here really using their intuition and uh, 
that could be staying on the course and closing this off, stepping from one cycle into another. But you know, when you step from one cycle into another, you could walk around to the back door and come in through the same cycle. Let's just pull one more card, Spirit. Nope, nope. Here it is, the argument. The argument, there is no way in hell that Libra's going to have anything to do with this. No, no way in hell. Not the energy that Spirit's pointing me towards today, because I really got... I really got that, Libra. It's been a hell of a go for you. It has been your own secret nightmare. And I do feel that karma came in and swung it around. I do believe that your person, in which we speak of, is now in their own secret nightmare. I really do feel that <laughs> there's no doubt it's going to be genuine when they come back and offer you this path. And when they offer you this path, now I don't know why Spirit made me say that because I've never said it in any other of my readings, although I, once in a while I've thought it. You can take the devil's path, you can make him deal with the devil, or you can make a deal with the universe. Right there, which path? And it appears that Libra believes that she may be dealing, or he may be dealing, I'm sorry about that, guys, that they may be dealing with someone that they don't want to deal with again. Someone that's truly hurt them. So let's carry on here in what we have, definitely. We have Pisces, we have Fire, Aries, Leo, Sag. What's prominent? Aries. Uh, definitely have Pisces, lots of cups. We have Aquarius. Libra is here doubled up. Doubled up in Libra, very, very strong. We have Cancer. We have Sedge. Wow, wow, wow. Pisces again. It is just crazy. Um, just crazy here. Um, with the judgment, judgment blows its mighty horn. We've got a Scorpio. Just give me a moment, darlings. Let me figure it out here, please, and thank you. Wow. Yeah, we have Aries here with the Emperor. The High Priestess, we have a Cancer. With the Star, we have the Aquarius. And I believe that that's all I have with Temperance. We've got a Sedge. All right. Before I go, Libra, let's pull one or two Angel Answer cards for you. One or two Angel Answer cards. And we'll call it a night. God love you, darlings. Let's go. Spirit, Spirit says one cut, do it now, get her on, get her done, let's go. What do we got? Helpful people. There you go, Libra. Helpful people. So you probably have someone that might be helping you out with the pain and the suffering that you went through. So stick with your people there. And let's go. Trust. Okay, so... I guess trust in yourself, trust in the divine, trust in the path that you're going to take. Trust in you, trust in your intuition. Libra, thanks for joining me tonight. Namaste.